what is going on jeremiah black development network um uh, make sure you like subscribe comment uh appreciate the um comments man um you guys really love the last couple of videos so i appreciate that uh, much love um nick cannon uh we're gonna talk about him real quick but i feel like we're gonna talk about more than just like the the kids aspect i feel like we're gonna to also talk about um a comment that was also made underneath that one um that nick cannon was talking about so um long story short uh nick cannon is supposedly has two more kids on the way um uh last three days ago he did lip service with angela yee um and he actually confirmed three kids uh, uh, Nick, i gotta ask you about a story we saw okay it says you have three babies on the way is that true or false well when you say on the way <laughs> <laughs> You know what? God damn it, Nick. What, what count you at? I'm like, let's just put it on this the way. They're not here yet. Yeah, well, yeah. <laughs> I mean, they're coming. They're so, the way. stork is on the way. The stork this, has the package. Yes, there's, there's, there's. That damn three? I don't, I don't know. know. It could be. Uh, you know, we just. <laughs> No, I, I, this is what I said. If you thought the numbers I uh, put up in 2021 was gonna, <laughs> wait, wait till you see you um, that are possibly on the way. Um, and I think he has a total of nine children. Um, even after losing uh, his uh, one child, which you know that's super sad. Rest in peace. Um, and so we're gonna talk a little bit about that. But I also want y'all to see uh, the. Um, what was what was said afterwards now before uh, before i really start this off man all this shit is his business um if he wants to have nine children um he is seemingly doing this um on purpose uh he uh he talks about how he wants to have a lot of children um and um there's nothing there's nothing wrong with that personally in my opinion uh however um, where I see the problem being is I actually do agree with the statement that is uh, created and that Nick is, cre and I would love to have this conversation with Nick. Um, does he fear that he's creating these homes with these children um, that are going to want um, their father around them? Um, because personally, um, if I'm Nick Cannon, uh, you you have nine children by nine different women or something in between there, that number. You have nine children by nine different women. So you're going to have to stretch yourself uh, between nine different families uh, and, you know, be the father, be there. Um, not just about, it's not just about money. Um, it's also about you being there um, in their lives, being present. I'm spending the time and the energy. And some kids, man, they need more times than others. Uh, we don't know if these kids, you know, may have, I don't know, birth defects. And I'm, purpose, I'm like I said, I'm hoping that, you know, he has nine healthy children. But again, we don't know how that's going to work out. Um, and even so, even without like mental disabilities or um, or disorders or things like that, even without all that stuff, you know, raising these children, uh, now, let me also say this, especially for the ladies, that these women are absolutely um, cool with having as children. Um, they have accepted the responsibility, even knowing that, you know, he has other children out there on the way. Um, and so the one thing I do want to say is, is that, uh, you know, I, I can't argue that specific point. Um, when you have women that are, you know, cool with actually sitting laying down and having his child knowing that he has other kids to tend to and things like that but nevertheless i still think that he's creating the um broken home scenario because again these kids got to grow up and he's going to still have to be working um somewhat i know he has a lot of money i know people are saying that he has a lot of money he has a lot of work that he's doing and things of that nature and that may as well be true but the circumstances might change at any moment. And again, he still has nine children to take care of. Uh, and so, you know, the one thing that I, I want him to at least be cautioned about is um, the creation of, of, of these children. Um, he's, he actually did uh, the lip service um, interview and I kind of want to know his, uh, his intentions with all this stuff. I just don't feel like everybody's asking him the real questions like, 
like what's the plan like how do you plan on at least being there for these children um and how do you plan on because you're intentionally doing it so um what do you, what do you see i mean your futures of being the father and things like that what's the negotiation that you've um made with these women outside of just having a kid um because i think especially when it starts getting he getting into the the double digits uh, when it starts getting there. Like you know, what do you? What is your plan? Um, at least with um, Kiki Wyatt, she has um, double digit kids, if I'm not mistaken. But I believe, uh, don't quote me on this, but I believe she has majority of those children with one man. So if anybody knows that situation, let me know. Um, I could be wrong on that, but I think she has majority of those children with one guy, the the guy that she's married to. Um, and that's where, you know, I don't have a problem with it because at least there's one stable man. They're all in the same household. And so he's not stretching himself out going from different households in order to, you know, um, keep these kids whole. They are all under the same roof. Um, and they are, um, that's where he's going to see most of his his work at is he's still gonna be exhausted but you know that's where he's gonna see most of his work at all in all man um yeah like it is what it is you know nick cannon has his children it is what it is um you know this isn't to i love nick cannon um i think he's one of the um most underrated um celebrities out there he has a, a very good career um but all in all man sometimes it's also not about money it's also about being present in these um these kids lives um, as well. And, uh, making sure that you spend a, an adequate amount of time with these children. Um, that's why I don't really believe in just simply just going out there and having, um, this many kids with, uh, this many women. Um, I'm, I'm 30 myself. I don't have children yet because I want to be married. Um, when I have my kids, I want us to have a stable foundation, um, a love that they can come into, um, uh, where both parents, um, can give them adequate amount of time and energy towards each other. Again, I don't have Nick Cannon money either, so that's also a part of my intentions as well, right? Like, I'm not, you know, uh, I don't have that type of money on me to, to even think about having that type of children. And personally, I'm gonna be real with you, even if I did have that type of money, two kids is my max. Um, you know, I also don't wanna tire out my future wife or anything of that nature. But um, yeah, uh, like, subscribe, comment, man. Uh, let me know y'all feelings on this, bro. Uh, I think it's, um, I don't think it's toxic necessarily, but when we're talking about creating broken homes, um, this is kind of how it goes, whether it's intentional or not. So that's just me, man. Like, subscribe, comment. Peace out.